popped into the head of everybody in my business who has ever been told what I've been told, that this is going to be the last edition of your show. You go directly to the scene from the movie Network, complete with the pajamas and the raincoat. And you go off on an existential, otherworldly, verbal journey of unutterable profundity and vision. You damn the impediments and you insist upon the insurrections. And then you emit Peter Finch's guttural, resonant, so. And you implore, you will the viewer to go to the window, open it, stick out his head and yell. Well, you know the rest. In the mundane world of television goodbyes, reality is laughably uncooperative. When I resigned from ESPN 13 and a half years ago, I was literally given 30 seconds to say goodbye at the very end of my last edition of SportsCenter. As God is my witness, in the commercial break just before the emotional moment, the producer got into my earpiece and he said, uh, can you cut it down to 15 seconds so we can get in this tennis result from Stuttgart? So I'm grateful that I have a little more time to sign off here. Regardless, this is the last edition of Countdown. It is just under eight years since I returned to MSNBC. I was supposed to fill in for the late Jerry Nachman for exactly three days. Forty-nine days later, there was a four-year contract for me to return to this nightly 8 p.m. time.